What's up guys, uh, back here with a uh, quick update on a tank. I don't know if you guys remember, this was the uh, three gallon. Uh, uh, the tank is the E-Live Aqua Duo 3. This was the tank that had the aquaponics filter and you could grow plants out of the filter and whatnot. I never really used it for that and I actually went ahead and replaced the filter uh, about a month ago, saw some issues and really wasn't liking the way it was performing, so I replaced it with a, uh, that's one of those Tetra Whisper filters right there. Good filter, haven't had any issues with it. Uh, quiet filter too, I really don't even notice that it's there. Um, one thing I did, I kept the, the LED lights from that uh, E-Live Aquaponics filter. The lights were pretty light, uh, pretty bright, excuse me. Never had an issue with those, so I kept those. Uh, let's see, what did I do differently? Obviously, um, rescaped it. Pretty much did a complete overhaul. Um, had some fun with the gravel, uh, with the blue and the red and the white and that kind of thing. Uh, kept my friend here, Jaws. Uh, he's he's going to stay with me a little bit longer. I'm um, still rocking the driftwood. I got two Anubius plants in there. Uh, I got a Java farm back here and another one back over there that you can see and um, you can't really see them but there's a few there's a couple right there neon tetras in there uh, I've had those for about a month month and a half they seem to be doing well um, but like I said just a quick quick update let me know what you guys think um, Thinking I might put an air stone in here just to kind of move the water around a little bit. You know, there's decent water flow in there, but I'd like to have a little more. So I'm thinking an air stone might, uh, might help a little more. But um, again, just a real quick update. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, any questions or comments, I'd love to hear from you guys. So talk to you guys down the road. And... Um, you guys have a good one.